Hi everyone, it's Susan in Texas. I want to give you a quick update on that tuxedo shirt. Y'all gave me so many great suggestions, but I went with probably some of the simplest steps that I, I could do. I um, shortened it by about six inches all the way around. I cut off the collar that was really bugging me. I'm going to uh, put some sort of clip on the back of the bow tie so it's easy to take on or take off. I took up the sleeve length and adjusted the shoulder seams by putting little tucks at the top. And I ran across this vest that I had thrifted several months ago um, and thought it looked cute. I need to change out the buttons. And the bow tie and cover bun, I found at a thrift store for like $5. I'll probably leave it like it is for now, wear it some. I can always add paint or appliques or other, you know, bits and pieces to it later. What do you think? Bye for now. Hi everyone, it's Suzanne in Texas with another upcycle. I actually Frankenstein probably two or three blouses, a skirt and a tablecloth, and I don't remember. Anyway, they were all linen pieces and I morphed them together and made this dress. The drawstring that goes around the top was from the skirt and the pockets and the floral um, was from the tablecloth. The sleeves here, I haven't decided if I like them or not because they fall down a little too far. Might want to shorten them because, of course, my bracelets need to show. Anyway, tell me what you think if you have any suggestions for me. Appreciate it. Have a good day. Bye for now. Hi, everyone. It's Suzanne in Texas, and I wanted to show you one of the projects. I used all those uh, seam edge strip things to make. I actually just covered using hot glue a bucket hat that I found for five dollars and it took a little while and a lot of glue, glue but I really do like it. What do you think? Bye for now. It's been a while since I posted any of my recent projects. I've done dresses and shirts and hats and embellished hats and embellish more hats, embellish shoes with strips of fabric, and um, used men's ties to make roses or uh, a variation of a tie to be worn. And that's, you know, embellished all sorts of things and had fun. Thought you might want to see. Enjoy. Have a great day. Bye. Hi everyone, it's Suzanne in Texas with another quick upcycle. I took a man's flannel plaid shirt, a woman's uh, sweatshirt, and morphed them together and added a graphic from a t-shirt. I believe this is Joan of Arc. What do you think? Enjoy your day. Bye for now. Hi everyone, this is Suzanne in Texas along with Sugar, our mini schnauzer. We also have Pepper, who uh, isn't nearby right now, but I just finished a couple of sets of collars for them. This is sort of a Christmassy tone from an old shirt that I recycled or upcycled and an old bow that I had on hand using old uh, hardware from a previous collar. And I have another set that I'll post pictures of too. I made collars, I've made dog collars since 2004, 20 years. And I sold on Etsy for over a decade and have arthritic hands from all the bows that I made. Anyway, you might give it a try with all your extra scraps. They make great little gifts for the holidays. Bye for now.